Hey, bug on. Oh. Yeah, I'll get that. Hang on. There you are. Your shut off valve is on. Oh, for goodness Circuit sakes. breakers, already checked those. They're all in. I hate when people do this. Put it in the seat. Oh, that's why it's not sliding. It's got stuck. All right. Mark 382, load contact, Mount Sparks, good day. All right, oil pressure is good. And we the weather. All right. Oh, wow, this is actually Flight perfectly adjusted. In use. For VFR flight following, notify ground control. Of course. Have this weather information from Mississippi and surrounding states. Available on flight service frequencies. Advise on initial contact, you have Yankee. Auto branch time information, Yankee, 16500 Zulu. Wind 270 at 5, visibility 10. Sky clear below 12,000. Temperature 33, dew point 24. Altimeter 3002. Visual approach, runway 18 in use. All right, that's the weather. Altimeter is 3002. Runway 18 with Yankee. Flight instrument. Airspeed zero, attitude level, that is at 400 within 75 feet, about a step. Turn coordinator, wings level, ball centered, heading indicator, almost perfect. And then vertical speed zero. All right, yeah. flaps, let's get our flaps up. And we'll get the taxi clearance. All right, ground system 5253 Papa with Yankee. We're pressing flight following to the east part of the area at or below 3,500. Mm -hmm. 5233 Papa on branch ground, runway 18, taxi, Charlie Alpha, maintain out below 2,000. Watch frequency, 125.8, squawk 0332. 1918, via Charlie Alpha, at a level of 2000, the portrait frequency, 125.8, squawk 0332, 5233, Papa. That's 33, Papa, read back, correct. Right. All right. Yes. And brake check. My brakes work, no test yours? Uh, yeah. Okay. All right, your brakes work. Good. Now uh, we're going left to Charlie Alpha at a 18. Don't fly out, please. <laughs> All right, do you want a taxi? Uh, yeah, even with a foot that feels broken, I could probably still taxi. All right, put your hand on the throttle. We'll keep it around a 1,000. But you can add throttle if you need to in a turn or reduce it if we get to go too fast. That is a very nice pony. Okay, 98, runway 18, clear, touch and go. Okay, go right, right here on Charlie. We're clear to the left and clear to the right. We're going left on Alpha. Runway 18. Pull a little bit of power out, so don't go too fast. Give it a road around 1,000. Alright, maybe keep the yellow line between your feet. It likes pulling off to the right.
Oh, he gets over to the run-up area? Yep. Go all the way down to the end. I was turning and face the runway, add a little bit of power so we can turn sharper. All right, I'll make our feet straight and stop. All right. Nice. Before we take off, run up, brakes. Let's hold them. Run up area is clear behind us. Oil pressure, green arc, cabin doors. Good and closed. Yeah, I already checked mine. Seatbelts on flight controls. Grab the flight controls, turn left. Left aileron goes up, right aileron goes down, turn right, right one goes up, left one goes down. Look back, pull back, elevator goes up, push down, goes down, left rudder goes to the left, right rudder goes to the right. All right. Flight yes. instruments. Airspeed is still zero, attitude is still level, still at 400. Level, ball is in the center, that's still right, and that's still zero. Control valve is still on. Make sure you're rich, so put it rich. Okay. Elevator trim set for takeoff. It's about right there. And throttle 1700. Let's put the throttle up to 1700. Go slow. Okay. Make sure it's tight at 1700. Yeah. That's really, really sensitive. Kind of let it go. Crew track 503. All right, engine instruments. All right, engine instruments. Green. Green. And meter. Positive right now. We're going to turn the left one off so it turns the alternator off. It's negative. Turn it back on and it goes back positive. Suction gauge. Over there is in the green. Yes. Magnetos. We'll check those real quick. Play the key. We'll go one click to the left for the left mag. Okay, back to both. I will two clicks to the left for the right mag. Okay, back to both. All right. And carpet. Pull the carpet on. Oh. All right, now pull the throttle to idle. All the way up. Okay, throttle back to a thousand. And then carpet back in. We'll make sure, yep, rise on RPM. All right, radios. Switch over to Tower and Memphis. Yes, we're not using it right now. Transponder is on altitude in 0332. Lights. We got our beacon on already. Yep. Takeoff briefing. All right, we're going to do a normal takeoff. So, car peed in, flaps up. We'll go full power, rotate at 50, climb out about 70 to 80. And emergency briefing. We have an emergency on the ground. We're just going to pull off. Emergency in the air right after takeoff. We'll land straight ahead. Emergency in the air after takeoff above a thousand feet. We're going to try to turn back to the runway. You ready? Right. Yeah. All right. Pull up to the hold short line. You can tell when we get there and stop. You can say Olive Branch Tower, Cessna 523 Papa, hold short runway 18, ready for departure. All right. Stop right here. Go ahead and make your call. Oh, branch ground, Cessna 5233 Papa, holding short, runway 18, ready for departure. Oh, branch tower, not ground. Cessna 5233 Papa, all branch tower, hold short of runway 18. Hold short, 1833 Papa. Oh, yeah, I see several of them down there. Oh, this guy's got his landing lights on. Eight nine eight. Traffic will be a Cessna departing between you and traffic on the half mile final. Runway one eight. Clear. Touch and go. Looking for traffic. Clear. Touch and go. Eight nine eight. Yeah, I see both mine right and this Cherokee that's landing. Let's see how good of a landing you do. All right. Good approach. You're a little bit off of the 
left of it. Oh, fast. And pretty big smooth. Tower 798 would like to make oh, this a full stop. So 898, runway 18, clear to land. He's a full stop. Runway clear to land, 798, 98. Oh, it was pretty smooth, but he still bounced. Don't know how that's possible. Retract 503, taxi Echo Alpha, Delta to the ramp, on to ground point two. Echo Alpha Delta to the ramp, monitor ground point two, crew check 503. Cessna 33, Papa, turn left hitting 090, runway 18, clear for takeoff. Left hitting 090, clear for takeoff with you, Papa. Oof. Sorry about the tower. I got confused yeah, there. It's alright, it happened. Alright, you ready? Yep. Okay, heels on the floor, so we're not on the brakes. And full throttle. A little bit of right rudder. Keep your hand on the throttle. Alright, engine instruments are all in the green. Airspeed's coming along. Oof. Bump it across the Rotate at 50. Oh, uh, quit squealing at me. It was really already trying to rotate. Look at the wind suck. Holy Jesus. It took off of the tailwind. That's why it was so rough. Supposed to fly with a headwind, not a tailwind. Oh, I see a uh, air poop <laughs> over there, too. <laughs> woo! Man, this... Woo! Yeah, they need to change the runway or something. Man, there's so many hawks. Alright, whenever we get to 900, we'll turn left to 0 or 0. I'm trying to keep it in line. This wind is really pushing. Yeah, starting to pick up. I am dripping sweat right now. It's very hot. This is 3 3 Papa, contact Mr. Sparker. Mr. Sparker, Mr. Papa. Let's go left to the east. Alright. All right, hopefully, Jesus, all down. The nose down just a little bit. All right. This is a departure, that's a 5235, we're departing all of our coming 1,102. Number 235, Mr. Spots, I did not Come on, you can do it. Charles 4152, can I get Mr. Spots? Nose low, we're off on the east. Yep, there we go. Number 33, Papa, with our contact, miles southeast, out of Vance Airport. Slid into the Memphis Bravo Airspace, proceed on course, east practice area, maintain VFR. Clear the Bravo and proceed on course, east practice area, maintain VFR, 50 Papa. Alright, we're at 1,400, let's go up to 2,500. Alright. And we'll watch out, these clouds are kind of low, so we'll just keep an eye out for them. What the heck is that? I just got up to, up to 2,000. Right. The Fayette County for the clouds are at 2,200. Need to update the VTOR at Olive Branch. I think it was a pretty intense uh, crosswind or tailwind, actually. It was a tailwind, yeah. It was a pretty intense one. They're all going to feel intense with a tailwind. You're not supposed to take off from land with a tailwind. All right, let's level off at 2,000, and we'll keep flying east and see where we think the clouds are at. I'm going to start pulling some power out. Nose down a little bit more. We'll keep pulling. It's got a really long throttle, so you just gotta get used to watching the RPM. A little bit more nose down. You can do some nose down trip. Trip if you need to. Alright. Ooh, feels like I'm going in a storm or something. Hey, it trims about perfect right here. Are you sure? The nose is still coming up. I right. want the nose to be right here. Oh, I feel bad. <laughs> 
Oh, really? Go up that. Hold on. All right, we can't get high because of these random clouds. Yeah. So we're going to stay low, and we can do ground reference maneuvers. I was also thinking of doing more slips, but this time I'm landing. Okay, we can do it. A little bit more nose down. That cloud does not look friendly. It does not, actually. <laughs> Although you can barely see the blue sky above it. Yeah. Whew. I finally got rid of that sweat that was building up. Looks like we're headed right for those clouds right there. Let's go down a little bit. Pull right. the car feed out, pull some power out. And we'll descend some. Oh, they're good about 1800. You can do it. You can do it. <laughs> All right. We're about there. So Good, you add the power back in and we'll level off. Memphis information, Papa Current, altimeter 3003. Let's see what Memphis is saying the weather's doing. Information Papa, 16540, with Tom, visibility 10, feeling 2, 5,000 broken, temperature 33. Oh, come on, how are we gaining altitude? Our nose is literally pointing down. <laughs> Got a little bit of power in there still. All right, then. There you go. <laughs> Solution solved. Or problem solved, I mean. Contact approach one. Right, now let's go left to heading zero six zero.
right. Let's see if you can see anything outside of your window that would be good for turns around the point. Anything kind of small. Uh, water tower? Zulu current altimeter 3003. Okay, let's use the water tower. So we're a little bit far away from us. Let's get a little bit closer to it. Head to the right. information from Mississippi and surrounding states. I'm going to go off my service frequencies. Advise on initial contact, give you anchor. All right, sound information Zulu, 1715 Zulu, set 1050 at 13. That's not bad one. Not really, though. 3,700 scattered. 4,300 scattered. I actually felt that one. <laughs> so this, we'll hold this heading for now, and we'll get closer to it. And then whenever you think you should, start turning around it. We'll try to get the same distance all the way around it. Now don't let the wind push you, okay? Uh, it's like shallow bank, so we don't get too close to it. Actually, the red bug here is fine. There we go, yeah. Also, a little bit more bank. Not too much. You want to still be able to see it with the wind. There we go. Try to hold it right there. All the way around the circle. Uh, a little bit less bank now. Now I'll tell you how it's moving kind of in front of us, like a little bit less thing. So we try to keep it at the middle part of the wing. There you go, good. Now look inside and watch your altitude. So you want to keep your eyes moving. Don't just look at the water tower the whole time. Look at the water tower, look at your instrument, make sure your standard rate turns just about, airspeed looks good, and look out in front of you to make sure you're not wee or wee, okay? So you want to look out in front of you, make sure your nose is level, look at your instruments, make sure you're where you need to be, and look at the water tower. And a little bit less bank because we're starting to get kind of close to it. Let's roll out and look for something on the right side. I want to see if you do it to the right. The right is always going to be harder. Field jet 622, Let's keep turning. Center, 1, 2, 4, so there's 3, a 5, house right out. there. We'll get a little bit closer so you can see it better. This heading for now. See that house I'm talking about? In the middle of the green field, the bright green one? Uh, no. You see the dark green, the bright green grass? Uh, yeah. Look at the bright green, not the dark green. There's a house in the middle of it. Oh, yeah, that one. We Sorry. can use that house. Alright. Nymph approach, Medivac 404, Alpha Echo. Medivac 404 Alpha Echo, Memphis Approach, IDENT, altimeter 3003. 3003, Keep flying this way for right now. Make sure you're not climbing. 
Alpha Echo, Ritter, contact right, uh, start 18 miles south of Memphis Airport. You're there we go. Trying to keep the same distance from the house the whole time. Well, the Center first base. Alpha Echo, inbound, Baptist Sea. We got some wind coming from this way, right? Yeah, and then when we get around the other side, we want to make a little bit of a steeper bank so we don't get pushed away from it.